Hello students, welcome back to my channel. Hope all are doing well and uh, uh, in the previous video students, uh, we have learned the ketoenol totamerism in acetoacetic ester. Hope you have watched that video. If you haven't watched it yet, please kindly uh, check the uh, channel, check for the play playlist totamerism so you will find it and kindly write down in your notebook. In this video, uh, today we are going to learn the applications of acetoacetic ester. There are a number of uh, application students uh, from acetoacetic ester, many compounds can be uh, prepared. So under this uh, applications of acetoacetic ester, this class we are going to learn preparation of monocarboxylic acids. So what is a monocarboxylic acid? Uh, for this, uh, you should go and check for the uh, introduction and classification of carboxylic acids, which uh, is there on my channel. Monocarboxylic acids means uh, the carboxylic acids containing one COH group. Okay, so today uh, here now we are going to learn how monocarboxylic acids can be prepared from acetoacetic Yes, sir. So, kindly put the, open your notebook students, uh, applications of acetoacetic ester, put the heading and uh, kindly write down the side heading, preparation of monocarboxylic acids. Preparation of monocarboxylic acids. Okay, students. So, we will start uh, uh, with the acetic acid, number one. Acetic acid. You all must be knowing the formula of acetic acid, right? What is it ma? CH3COOH. So what we are learning today? Applications of acetoacetic ester. That means preparation of acetoacetic acid, acetic acid from acetoacetic ester. So first put the heading, side heading. Acetic acid, write its formula. You should be knowing the uh, formula of the compound also. So to start with, uh, here we need to take, uh, what is this ma? Acetoacetic ester. CH3, C double bond O, CH2, C double bond O, O, C2, H5. This is the easiest uh, reaction. So, what? how acetic acid is prepared? Put an arrow and this acetoacetic ester, when it is treated with concentrated alcoholic KOH. So here we call it as acidic hydrolysis because hydrolysis takes place in the presence of concentrated alcoholic KOH producing carb monocarboxylic acids. Okay, so that's the reason we are uh, calling it as acidic hydrolysis. So simple concentrated alcoholic KOH, we are getting two molecules of acetic acid 2 CH3COOH. But uh, if I write the reaction like this, you will be having a doubt uh, where hydrolysis has taken place in acetoacetic ester. Okay. So first write the reaction CH3C double bond O. Note down this ma. Compound acetoacetic ester, concentrated alcoholic KOH, acidic hydrolysis and two molecules of acetic acid. Okay. So now I will show you how hydrolysis has taken place. So here the bond breaks. Okay, bond breaks and hydrogen this side and OH this side. Okay, H, OH. So now this is coming out as CH3, COOH. And next molecule of water adds up here. Here this bond breaks and here hydrogen, here OH. Okay, so C2H5OH is going out. So, we will mention here minus C2H5OH below the arrow. Write down here students, minus C2H5OH. So, this is the way how hydrolysis takes place when esterostic ester is treated with concentrated alcoholic KOH. Okay, so CH3, C double bond O, OH is one molecule of acetic acid and CH2 hydrogen, CH3, COOH. 
second molecule of acetic acid and C2H5OH will be coming out. Fine? Clear? Okay. Next, moving on to second one, preparation of propanoic acid. Put the side heading propanoic acid. Its formula CH3, CH2, COOH. Okay, there are three carbons, one COOH, hence it is a monocarboxylic acid having three carbons, CH3, CH2, COOH. To start with, uh, write down acetoacetic ester, CH3, C double bond O, CH2, C double bond O, O, C2, H5. So, before uh, adding concentrated alcoholic KOH, so acetic acid means direct we get acetic, uh, acetoacetic ester, uh, acetic acid can be prepared directly by adding concentrated alcoholic KOH. So here one carbon is increased in propanoic acid. So first it has to be treated with sodium ethoxide NaO C2H5. So what it does students NaO C2H5 what happens when this is added to acetoacetic ester? This is the active methylene group. So one of the hydrogens of the active methylene group will be taken up by OC2H5. This is ethoxide ion. So OC2H5 plus one of the hydrogens, it comes out as minus C2H5OH. So what remains here? Na remains. Fine. So next C. CH3, C double bond O, CH. Now this hydrogen is not there. So, hydrogen will be replaced by sodium Na, C double bond O, O, C2, H5. Okay. So, in the presence of sodium ethoxide, we are getting here in the place of hydrogen, sodium is uh, replaced. Fine. Next, uh, what is to be done? To this, uh, we have to add CH3I. So, what is CH3I? Methyl iodide. So, what happens when methyl iodide is added? This Na and this I will come out as sodium iodide minus NaI. What remains here? CH3. Now, this Na will be replaced by the methyl group. So, entire compound will be same but in the place of Na, we are supposed to write CH3. Look here, CH3. C double bond O, CH, CH3, C double bond O, O, C2, H5. Now, methyl group is introduced. Next comes concentrated alcoholic KOH. This you have to remember. Ma. Concentrated alcoholic KOH is uh, the reagent used in the preparation of uh, uh, this uh, carboxylic acids from estoestic ester. Okay, so after adding concentrated alcoholic KOH, hydrolysis takes place and finally we get CH3CH2COOH. So how this hydrolysis takes place? So here this bond will be broken. This bond will be broken and CH3 C double bond O hydrogen this side water molecule. OH this side okay so CH3 COOH next CH3 CH2 C double bond O and here it breaks fine so H this side and OH this side Same like how we did in the case of uh, uh, acetic acid. Okay. So hydrolysis takes place uh, uh, like this. And what are we getting students? Minus CH3COH minus C2H5OH. So the final compound CH3, CH2, C double bond O, OH, which is nothing but propanoic acid. Easy? Yes. Next. So, what we will do here is, next higher compound is butanoic acid. Okay. When all the four carbons are in a straight chain, we call it as N-butanoic acid. Third compound, N-butanoic acid and it is CH3, CH2, CH2, COOH. So, you just try it at home 
okay so try doing it i am not giving i am not showing you the preparation of n butanoic acid so you try it on your own okay taking propanoic acid as example fine so how you will do whether uh, uh, you are able to do or not please let me know in the comment section if you are not able to do it i will uh, show the preparation of n butanoic acid okay so moving on to next compound number 4 isobutyric acid isobutyric acid it has four carbons only but its structure is like this ch3 ch ch3 COOH it is this is called as isobutyric acid now how will uh, we we prepare this compound from esteroestic ester so take esteroestic ester ch3 c double bond o ch2 c double bond o o c2 h5 now we are supposed to add here 2 nao c2 h5 okay so how many hydrogens are there in the active methylene group two hydrogens okay so these two hydrogens now will be replaced by this uh, two sodium and uh, what happens is so two nao c2 h5 so one o c2 h5 minus plus h plus one c2 h5 oh second o c2 h5 minus plus a second h plus two c um, one more c2 h5 oh so total i have written minus two c2 h5 oh now these hydrogens these two hydrogens will be replaced by two sodium atoms and what are we getting here ch3 c double bond o c na na now two hydrogens are not there c double bond o o c2 h5 so here what are what are we supposed to add previously in propanoic acid we added one methyl iodide but here we are supposed to add two ch3 i two molecules of ch3 i so what happens when you are adding two ch3 i this na this i this na and this i will come out as two na i so below the arrow i have written minus two na i now what comes here students in the place of na in the place of na what is remaining here two methyl groups so here one ch3 here one ch3 next write down ch3 c double bond o c ch3 ch3 c double bond o o c to h5 here takes place hydrolysis add concentrated alcoholic koh and uh, minus ch3 cooh so here the bond breaks h oh okay so minus ch3 cooh and uh, here also the bond breaks here comes h here comes oh so minus c2h5 oh so what is remaining students ch3 ch ch3 coh that is our isobutyric acid clear so next one students pentanoic acid five carbons so ch3 ch2 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 coh all are in a straight line hence we call it as n pentanoic acid this also you will be doing on your own try to do it students you will enjoy organic chemistry i i say uh, if you understand the concept it will be very easy for you okay so this also i am leaving it for you next sixth compound isovaleric acid what is the structure of isovaleric acid it has uh, uh, five carbons it also has one cooh group look here the structure ch3 ch ch2 cooh here there is methyl group so this is we call it as isopropyl group fine so how to prepare isovaleric acid from esteroestic ester same we will start with the esteroestic ester write down the compound so treat with naoc2h5 so one hydrogen one oc uh, this oc2h5 comes out as C minus c2h5 oh so na will be replaced in the place of hydrogen ch3 c double bond o ch na ch na c double bond o oc2h5 now here what is to be added in this uh, 
is you know to replace uh, which group has to be replaced in the place of uh, Na. So here I have written isopropyl iodide. CH3, CH, CH3, I. So this I and Na comes out as NaI and this isopropyl group will be replaced in the presence of uh, sodium. So next comes CH3. Can you able to, are you able to see students? Yes. CH3, C double bond O, CH. Now here in the place of Na, write this isopropyl group CH. CH3, CH3. Next is same. C double bond O, C2H5. So final step is hydrolysis in the presence of concentrated alcoholic KOH. So how hydrolysis takes place? Uh, uh, it's like same uh, we have seen in the previous compounds. So here the bond breaks H, OH. Next here the bond breaks H this side, OH this side. So what will be going out? CH3, COOH will be going out. C2H5 will be coming out and this is the final compound. Look here students. CH3, this CH3, next CH, next CH2, COOH. Don't forget to write this methyl group. Ma. CH3, CH, CH2, COOH and there is a, a methyl group over here. So, this is CH3, CH, CH3, CH2, COH. This is isovaleric acid. Next students, seventh compound, one more valeric acid, active valeric acid. So, what is the difference between iso and active valeric acid? It also has five carbons, but its structure is like this. CH3, next CH2, CH. Here it has methyl group CH3, COOH. Okay. So this is the main fragment students which can be prepared uh, by hydrolysis. So on this carbon, what are the groups that has to be, uh, we have to introduce that we should check. So on this carbon, one methyl group is there and ethyl group is there. Okay. So these two groups have to be introduced uh, then if we do hydrolysis, we will get this compound, okay. So, how it is uh, done, uh, let me show you. First, take acetoestic ester. Next, uh, so two uh, groups are to be introduced, right. So, two uh, hydrogens has, have to be uh, removed, replaced. So, taking two NaOC2H5, two hydrogens, two OC2H5 groups comes out as two C2H5OH. Here these two hydrogens will be replaced by sodium and next comes CH3, next C double bond O, next C, Na, Na, C double bond O, O, C2, H5. Next put an arrow. See look here, here what is to be added? CH3, I, methyl iodide, okay, and ethyl iodide. Because we need two groups, one is methyl group and the other is the ethyl group. So taking methyl iodide and ethyl iodide. So two sodium atoms, two iodine atoms comes out as two sodium iodide, two NaI and this Na replaced by uh, this ethyl group, this Na replaced by methyl group. Okay. So next CH3, C double bond O, C, CH2, CH3, here CH3, C double bond O, OC2H5. Next is hydrolysis using concentrated alcoholic KOH. So hydrolysis takes place, C2H5OH and CH3COH will be coming out. And what remains is CH3, CH2, CH, CH3, COOH. Same comp uh, this is the compound, CH3, CH2, CH, CH3, COH. This is uh, active valeric acid. Okay, students. So, this is all about preparation of monocarboxylic acids from acetoacetic ester by acidic hydrolysis and the reagent used is concentrated alcoholic KOH. Okay. So, please note down in your notebooks and kindly practice. Don't forget to like the video, students, and share with your friends. And also, those who are watching for the first time, please subscribe the channel. Okay. Okay, students, take care. Meet you in the next video with a new topic.